Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to the vlog. We are actually at UCLA right now. Well, just pulled up into the parking structure. Little baby is right here. Say hi, Adelina. Say hi. See, I'm going with mom to the doctor Let's today. Down, right? Yeah, go down. Let's go. Going down to the parking lot, little baby. Say yeah, I finally get out of my car seat, moms. So we just made it in the parking lot. We are about to head to my cardiologist first, my congenital heart doctor. I have the fam here. Say hi, mom. Yeah, it's Adelina's second time here at UCLA and my millionth, so that's nice. Mask time. You ready, mamas? Mm -hmm. You ready? Adelina's happy to be out of the car seat. It's mm -hmm. a long drive, huh? This mask is like huge, but it is what it is. Yeah, you see all the lights? The one? Yeah, one. I'll turn down, I'll turn down first. Oh, we probably went in the wrong one. Oh, wow. Uh, Hi! Hi! Are you telling them something? Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're funny. You're funny, chica. You happy to be in LA? Look at Adelina's shirt is so cute, you guys. It says, save the planet, raise a hippie. <laughs> oh, yeah. So we're going to that building right there. Nice, though. <laughs> Adelina said, don't talk to me on the elevator, people. No, honestly, I don't even know if she's been in the elevator, to be honest. There. That's how we know we're in the right spot. <laughs> we're going to be with a lot of old people now. Adelina is having the time of her life looking out this window, you guys. Honestly, it's such a beautiful view, though. Look. So, so stupid beautiful. <laughs> she loves it. And here we are in the doctor's office. They took my blood pressure and it was kind of high. Um, and the doctor's going to come soon, but I don't know how much I'm going to be vlogging of the actual appointment. But I will definitely keep you guys updated. Hey guys, so I just got done with both the doctor appointments. Um, I didn't vlog the second doctor appointment just because it was tough. Adelina was tired of being in the doctor's office, which I don't blame her for. And yeah, so everything actually went really good. The doctor that I was worried about, which is the pacemaker, I'm like sweating. Uh, the doctor that I was worried about, which was my pacemaker doctor, everything actually came back normal. I am having a little bit of arrhythmias, but it's nothing like crazy. And it's not my pacemaker, so that's good. And the one thing, though, that came out of today is that I do have to go on blood pressure medication. The same medication that I was on after I had Adelina because I had postpartum preeclampsia and my blood pressure was really high. Um, they're putting me on the same one just because I'm nursing and so hopefully that works out. And yeah, so that's where we are right now. That's the whole update for UCLA. I'm actually like really happy and so much less stress. Thank the good Lord above. Glory to him always. But right now, we are actually going to go see or yeah, go look at a Kobe mural. Where is it at? It's in Clover City? Yeah. Yeah, so we're gonna go look at a Kobe mural in Clover City, which is just a few miles down the road from UCLA. So yeah, that's what's next on the agenda. Adelina's chilling here. Do you wanna say hi? Look, you have milk. Oh, look at you're spilling your bottle. Nice, nice, nice. Such a nice day outside too. <laughs> Alright guys, so we found the mural. It's actually really nice and it was like down the street and there's nobody here. So that's pretty cool. We are walking to it right now. And yeah. I also forgot to say that I thought it was so funny because when I seen my pacemaker doctor, he was like, Well, this is such a boring visit. Like <laughs> 
and I literally almost got <laughs> ran over on camera. <laughs> but yeah. Look at how stunning this is, you guys. It's so detailed. So beautiful. I know Carlos is in heaven. Okay, so I had to go back to the car to get sunglasses because I cannot handle this LA sun. My eyes are literally burning. Someone just woke up from a nap. Hey guys, so we just made it back into town. Um, I didn't vlog on the way home because Adelina fell asleep the second that we got into the car. But we're actually in in and out drive through right now. We are so stinking hungry. We have not had anything to eat since breakfast. So we're waiting for our food and then we're gonna head home and relax. I know Carlos is tired because he's been driving all damn day. Right? Tired, yeah. <laughs> well, that's the plan and I'm just happy that we got good news at the doctor, so yeah. <laughs> Say good morning, guys. So it's been a couple days since I actually went to UCLA. And yeah, when I came home, I actually had like a really bad panic attack and like kind of blew up <laughs> and I didn't realize that my anxiety like had gotten to me until I got home. And so yeah, I just kind of been taking the past couple days to recoup and get myself together um, anxiety wise and then just having to be on medication now, which is something that I am not used to. And uh, I will say that I've been having a hard time remembering to take it my evening <laughs> dose, but I'm getting better at it. So that's good. We're just chilling. Um, it's morning if you can't tell. Um, Solomon's here. Chilling on the tablet. He literally looks like he's a teenager. Look at him, you guys. I cannot. He's getting so big. Someone's going to be six years old pretty soon. Who is it? Who's going to be a big bad six-year-old? All right, I guess he's camera shy, but yeah guys so we just ate breakfast and all of that stuff I figure that I might as well just vlog the rest of the day and share that with you guys because I don't want to just end the vlog like super Promptly because I know I didn't vlog too much over at UCLA either. It was honestly so hard To remember to vlog then COVID and everybody just looks at you weird and then having a screaming little crying baby sometimes but yeah so I'm actually gonna go run and grab some clothes that we just got at Alina so I can show you guys here what do you have to tell them say hey guys say hey guys I'm just cruising all day long on these couches like it's nobody's business so crazy we're planning her first birthday. It's gonna be so much fun, I can't wait. I cannot believe I'm gonna have a toddler pretty soon. That's so wild to me. Adelina has teeth. Oh yeah, Adelina does have teeth. Good update, Solomon. That's a good observation. So Adelina has six teeth now. She literally got all four top teeth and the two bottom chompers that have been there. And homegirl knows that she can bite now, which is not, not the business. But let's go get those clothes so that way we can show you guys. Okay guys, so here is like a little overview of some of the clothes that we got her. These ones are all actually from Walmart and I actually need to do her laundry pretty soon so I figure I'll just show you guys what we got her and then toss them in the wash. Let's start over here. This one's so cute. It's just like a little teal color with little floral prints. I love this little orange as well. And then it comes with some little cute denim shorts. Um, yeah, they're just like elastic on one side and then moving on I got her a couple pairs of biker shorts I thought these ones were so stinking cute with a little rainbow and then I just got her a solid pink pair as well And then these are all to fit her for summer for this summer here And then also just like this cute tie-dye shirt. I just liked it I figured she could probably wear it with these pink ones or what not and then this guy she seen and she needed it If you guys do not know Adelina loves baby shark so so when she spotted this, she just said, wow, wow, wow. And um, we watched the Baby Shark Adventure on Netflix. And that's actually part of the theme song. So she really wanted it. So 
we got it for her, but this guy is in a 2T, so it might not fit her for a little while, but I think I'm just gonna toss it in the wash and maybe she could wear an oversized t-shirt with some biker shorts, that might be cute too. And then this guy is just like a little bikini, which I think is so adorable. We are actually going like on a little staycation for 4th of July, so I picked this up for her. I actually got it in a 12 month and it was way too small, so this one is in a 2T. We ended up giving the other bathing suit to Adelina's little friend Violet, and then we just picked these guys up too, little shorts, super, super stinking cute, and then like a little sky blue tank top as well, and yeah. I also forgot that our Oshkosh in our town is actually like closing. So we picked up some things from there as well. So I figured I might as well just show you guys, make this like a little mini haul. <laughs> okay guys, so this is everything that we got at Oshkosh. Here's like a little overview. We got her some little socks. I actually put her in a pair already, so they're kind of like all messed up. We got her two little pairs of shorts. I think these are so stinking cute. I honestly love wearing shorts like this in the summer. Um, both of these guys are 24 months and I think 2T, which is basically the same thing. So yeah, a little yellow pair and then like a little corally pink pair, which is super adorable. Her dad had the biggest steal while we were there. Little Peppa Pig onesie. This is um, in 18 months. My girl loves Peppa Pig, so she made out with her pajamas this time around. So super stinking cute, and I love that it's a onesie because I can never find them in the big sizes. And then, of course, Oshkosh is known for their overalls, so we had to pick up a couple of pairs. This one's super cute. It's just pink and white pinstripes. This one is in a 12-month, although it does look super big for her right now, so it might take a little while for her to fit into these. But then we got the regular denim pair in... 18 month as well just so she has some options and I think it's gonna look so cute when her with her walking around because she's already over here getting into everything look at this mess that you made behind us while mama was just showing clothes oh no okay we gotta go huh say we'll see you in a little bit guys <laughs> 